more against Virgil. It was more no, against No, it wasn't Doom, Virgil. It was still Akuma. Akuma. So, it was still yeah. Akuma. But yeah, Ray Ray had a five game winning streak there. He had three. Or no, I guess not a five. Yeah, he did. Alucard, I think, won the first game of their set, and then Ray Ray won, Ray Ray won three in a row, and then he won two in a row against Unknown. Yeah, well, Unknown turned it yeah. all around. Yeah. 3 0 for himself to come back after Ray Ray's 2 0. Hey, Dave, I want to say one thing. I love community tournaments. I love community tournaments. There, this is the best. This is the best. Aren't all the tournaments community tournaments? I mean, there's there's a there's a thing about Civil War though where it, I kind of feel like it feels like how tournaments used to feel. Uh huh. Do so you get that feeling? I mean, that's yeah. Like there's like an arcade in the back. Yeah. All these little arcade cabs. Yeah. I don't know. That's I I feel, I feel like how I used to feel, which is nice. Yeah, apart, it's got apart that, from this whole business. It's got that. Yeah. It's got that the whole mess. right. Like we. Did MS. not we no. I used to wear this tournament all the time. Yeah, I used to be used commentating to, to nobody on no stream. I right, yeah, I know. It was I so to, fun. I used to do that too. Dude, everybody got so hyped for Marvel vs. Capcom 2 outside of the 300 people there. Oh yeah, I mean, but you actually used to do real. I I, I meant that I would just be like in a crowd and like be making a ton of annoying noise. Oh, you, I was, you you were the house man. You were the house man. Oh yeah, I did guy. do that a few times. Yeah, you did that a bunch, right? I did that a few times. Uh, but. But uh, Tragic was the guy that did that for so long. He was the guy that actually inspired me. Is that so? When I used to see him at Evo every year, I I was just like, I want to do that. I wanna, I want that. I wanna bring that hype. I feel like I can do it. Here I am. Yep. It's not me bringing the hype today, though. It's IGT Unknown and Chris G. Can't ask for a better Grand Finals than this. Probably the number one player in the world and the number one player from your home region and the major in your home region. Time to go nuts, cheer your head off, lose your voice. It was like, oh no, I must have ran to the restroom or something. Oh yeah, fair enough. Meanwhile, Chris G doing what he can do to warm up a little bit. Remember when this game didn't tell you you got a perfect? Yeah, that was disappointing. I know, man. That was like the only, well, the X-Factor was crappy too, like the X-Factor signal, remember? Yeah, yeah, in vanilla? Yeah, yeah. But, oh man, those life bars. So clear and obvious. <laughs> it's true. I still get screwed up sometimes. Still uh, like, wait, which one, which one is second? Which every one is once in a while, I do as well. Yeah. I don't know, if I do like... It's like that occasional brain fart. If I do like one TAC and a combo, then after that, like, I don't know what's happening anymore. <laughs> like, I don't know who's coming in after what. Like, whenever I do combos, I always have to, like, look at like look at the character portraits. And I'm like, wait, which assist is what? Instead of just being like, oh, it's, here's the list. Yeah, right. It, this is just how it works, you know? Now I know. No. Yeah. So, here's Unknown. Back fresh. And it's going to be Grand Finals. We already saw the two play in Winner's Finals where Chris beat Unknown 3-1. to one. And Unknown made a really nice comeback in that last set against Ray Ray. It was 2-0 Ray Ray before Unknown took three straight. Yeah, that guy was dead. Yeah. Chris G, I think, always feels confident in Marvel. Yeah, he, you know, he does. But I think for a player of his level, his caliber, he's like as vulnerable as possible. You know, just That's true. As, you know, he knows he's good and everything, but you know, he can be taken out of his element. I actually think that one of the good things about Chris is that he, I feel like he, even though he's, he can be confident, I feel like he, he takes it so to heart that he's always a little worried about it, which is a good thing because right. that, that spurs you to, to get better. Yeah. And so he has gotten better. Even as he's been dominating everybody, he's been finding better Morgan patterns. He's been doing better with Virgil. He switched from Akuma to Virgil in the right. first place, and he's still been upping his game. Yeah, they say that people that aren't nervous are amateurs. Even just a little bit. So we'll see what Unknown can do this time. Remember, he did pretty well against Morgan at the start in the previous uh, time they played, but it was they're not the rest of the team. It was... It was 3-1 in the winners. Last year, this exact same matchup was the grand finals of Civil War 4. Civil War 5 was the run back. It was 3-0. 
free O last year, and Jahia, our GT unknown, is saying to us, he got this. Wow, he got an answer. That pattern that Wesker happened to take right there was perfect. Yeah. Just, just under the fireball and then over the fireball after on the way back. Yeah, that was the grace of God helping him out. Stand, trying to stay away. Oh, that gun shot at that angle, at that spot on screen, I should say. It's not advised. If you're up, if, I mean, if you're above him, that's fine, but where he was at the time, risky. Oh, the chip damage here is so significant. Wesker done. Push block and then press the button. At this point, every sliver is, is crucial. Can't give oh, it away any life. I don't like this. She was above it. Oh! He was going for... Okay, he hard tack, got an air, uh, wow. air grab. Yeah, that was pretty sick, actually. And he's X Factor, so he can get more. Or not, or he or he can just totally whiff and Whoa. be as vulnerable as possible on the way I, down. I have actually never seen that happen. I don't even know how that, I don't know what happened. He wasn't close enough, that's all. That's like impossible. I've never seen that happen. Now, oh, Chris G forced the X Factor, Prince Meter. And he's letting Unknown back into the fight. Okay. No more meter for Chris. Really? Ooh, all the way back to Viper. Just knock him down! <laughs> Gets it this time. Yeah. So he's actually not in a terrible position in coming oh, on more again. Oh, he oh. avoids the drones. That's really, that was really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it totally nullified his setup and made, made uh, Viper uh, vulnerable as well. Hanging out, but what do you fall into is the problem. Yeah, it fell into about 20% of chip. Yeah, he was playing way harder than I would right now. Okay, yeah, yeah I'm like this game, this match is over. Maybe go up to the top and like sketch out a game plan for the next round. No, I guess he's confident in his game plan. Oh! That shell kick! Wow, she pressed the button even though drones were still there. I... Yeah, yeah, third hit of the drone. Yep. So he's, he's con... I mean, this is the game plan he's been using, right? Yeah. Kill Morgan, yeah. X-Factor against Morgan. Yeah. Uh, but, I mean, that's worked out in one game, precisely one game so far. Yeah. No, I think that in the long run, it is a better plan because uh, X-Factor, it's really not going to help you against Virgil. He's just gonna be fast and do a lot of damage, and you know, either you hit him or you don't. X Factor is actually useful against Morgan, either on defense or offense. So if you get her, you might want to go ahead and use it, and then just try to fight uh, Virgil honestly. Cause that's what you have to do anyway. We'll see how he deals with him here. Helmbreaker to keep him in blocks. Done missiles. Rapid slash is blocked. Tries to get the cross up. Helmbreaker won't go. And the rapid slash. Another cross up. But he drops the combo. And then uh, Jahi gets doomed. No, no, he thought he, he thought got he doomed. Had he thought he had two. Yeah, he thought he had two. Exactly right. Oh. But he didn't. Oh, it's too fast. It's just too fast. And also in that weird animation, you know, Virgil in X Factor, when he's in, in dark, he just... It looks it's weird. It's hard to see, it's, yeah. He's all red. Devil trigger sometimes looks weird. Yeah. Quick recovery from Chris here. Yeah. And... In the battle of characters regaining control after tense, tense moments, Virgil's pretty much the best. Can put swords up, tell you to chill out, draw a round trip, what have you. Yep, that's exactly what he's doing. It's got really quiet in here, that was weird. Well, yeah, I mean, you can, you can sense the crowd, how they're feeling right now. Oh, the missiles on the way up blew it up. Yeah, the crowd, as we were saying before, was really behind Jahi. Oh, he got the grab, avoided the missiles. Here's a chance. He wanted the reset, went for it, but so, okay, so he went for a reset which would have actually led into an air grab, which was the same thing that he had. He's not thinking straight. It's going to be 2-0 Chris. And he is at tournament game now. This is what Chris G's team does to you. It makes you look like a bad player. It puts you under so much pressure. Even the highest level Marvel players, the most experienced, the most seasoned, have trouble coming up with the right answer. When there is a right answer, but you just don't have enough time. You got it. You're sitting there getting chipped out. She shell kicking on top of your head. Three hit overhead. Goes very quickly. Speaking of going very quickly, this is looking like last year. Yeah. Almost a 3-0. 
2-0 so far with 3-1 in the winners finals. And immediately he went in. Yeah, I, I, I like I like the switch up. It's a good switch of styles. Uh, it was not what Unknown expected. Yeah, yeah, and, and, and Unknown started this game though pretty much the same. Besides the one where he went for 99 second Phantom Dance. He's going for Magnum plus assist. It's gotten him nowhere. He's probably trying to snipe her before she gets a fireball out, but... Yeah, I feel like he's just trying to be on top of or escape fireballs rather than really thinking about where the holes in the patterns are. It's all going downhill. Yeah. Oh, oh yes! Perfect! Needs to make this count. He needs to take a deep breath and, and close his eyes and go to training mode. Morgan's down. Okay. He's missed a lot of these mix-ups. Hard tag back, lost the red life there. Yeah, oh, and then dive. He didn't get the drones, and then he got the foot dive. All of his momentum was totally seated. He lost it because uh, Doom got out with that up back. Hanging out in block stun. X-Factor over great counter X-Factor. Chris knew what was coming. And Goes he up got to, he doesn't have to deal with drones. But here's the grab. I think he can... Oh, he didn't get Dragon Punch. What? Oh. He got Stan L. Oh my days. Oh my days. He, he, he's crushed. He, his, he literally had his face in his hands as he was getting that super. Like literally he was off the, the controller. He was not watching the screen. He I, had his face in his hands. If, the, if I had to have the microphone in my hand, I'd be off the mic too. Damn. Well. He didn't get Dragon Punch. Man, he is well, going to be feeling that for the entire next year. He didn't get Fireball earlier. That's right. You know what though? Uh, really, not to make any excuses for him. It was well played by Chris G. He's the best player in all. That's true. Um, I would just mention, I mentioned it yesterday, Unknown is actually playing on a stick. Yeah, that's true. He's a pad player. I mean, you're right, but he did get the Grand Finals. Oh, yeah. And, you know, when you're in Grand Finals, you don't want to be doing Miss Dragon Punches and stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. Like, that's, yeah. That's, that's, it's a heartbreaker. But, yeah, you're right. Yeah. I mean, about Chris. Chris is the best player. I think everybody knows that. Uh, he came in as the heavy favorite. doesn't matter which other players are at a tournament. Chris is the heavy favorite. Yeah. And he, he did 3-1 to one in Winners Finals. Christy then 3-0 over Unknown in Grand Finals. Chris had 3-0 over Rai Rai in Winners Semis. I mean, just a dominant, dominant Marvel weekend. How many games weekend. did Christy lose today? A one? Well, the rest of them are not really one, in, in 